I got my bib on. This is my bib. I wear it all the way all around the house, especially when I'm eating. Um, eating and cleaning. Oh, I splash bleach on my clothes if I don't. That cat. Go ahead, show your kitty. He's eating the cardboard. Mr. Tucks Tucker, don't get him near my food. Oh, he's a little baby. Yeah, he's a mean baby. Oh, yeah. Not one to be held. Your hair looks really good today. It's like voluptuous. I love it. Okay, you can you can go away now so I can talk. What do you want to say? You want to tell them about how horrible your life is? Go ahead. It's okay. I never realized I could get sick of meat. I just hate it now. Yes. I don't hate it. It still tastes good. But, I mean, this meat isn't seasoned. It doesn't have, like, breading. And it's not, it's not... Okay, so your problem's not with meat, it's with your mother, the cook, because I'm not a good cook. But anyways, like this chicken, I bought, we went grocery shopping yesterday. I left the kids at home so I could shop appropriately. And I got us some steaks and different things like that and ribs, and I'm going to cook some tonight. But I had this chicken defrosted. It was defrosted in the refrigerator, and I didn't want to waste it. I don't believe in wasting food. So I offered her some chicken, and she said no. But I did buy her some blueberries. You poor baby. I feel so sorry for you. It's going to be okay. I promise it will. Do you want a hug? Mm. You want some really bad chicken? Uh -huh. I got her some blueberries and cheese and stuff like that. But we're definitely... We definitely got the blues today because... But I ordered on some... Um, Protein shake mix that's keto and carnivore friendly. And when it gets here, I think that'll like make them feel better. Because they'll have something sweet and chocolatey. And it won't be so bad. Spenda isn't as good. I don't even think this has Splenda in it. The one I ordered. I don't think it does. Sorry. It's, it's not sweet. It's sweet, but it's it's got something else. It's like Splenda. <sighs> Splenda is not good. Yeah, it's not good. Anyways, the reason I got on the video today was to share that I lost another pound. So I've lost 15 pounds in total. And it is very slow for me. I can't deny that my weight loss is very slow, but it's transitioning a lot from fat to muscle because I've had some muscle. I don't know if this is, I'm still flabby, but see that, see that muscle? It's a little tiny muscle, but that's come in and I've got a few other muscles. I didn't even know I had in my legs and stuff. And oh, thank you. Anyways, that's what's going on. I lost another pound. So I officially lost 15. I want some pecan fries. Some pecan fries. I will make you I'm some. Sick of this. It's only been day one. It's only been day one for you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
I knew this was going to happen whenever I switched the kids over. And it's really unfair to them to like my eyeballs keeps shifting because I'm not used to this. It's really unfair to them to have to change over. It's very dramatic for them. But I think it's the right choice and I'm trying to do what's right. They can still have I'm limiting them to keto, so they can still have the green vegetables. They can still have um, the fruit, the berries. They can have the berries, and they can have, um, get your finger out of your mouth, child. How would you put your finger in your mouth? You just pet a cat. You know they get in the litter box and do all kinds of nasty stuff in there? Anyways, apparently it's, it's going to just, it's going to be weird for a while until they get used to this and until I get better at um, adding some treats for them, some keto treats or doing something that's kid friendly. And I think I've got, I've got an order. I can't find it here. We live in a real rural town and I can't find the pork um, panko, like the, the little chips. But I thought I could smush up some pork rinds, but I'm, I'm not really that intuitive, but I'm going to try a few things. And I found this really cool. I found this really cool. Um... I found this really cool um, YouTube site called Cook, Cook in Nashville with Chris. Chris Cook in Nashville, that's what it is. And he has a lot of keto um, varieties of dishes that I'm really interested in. And he shows like a carnivore variety too, but you know, for the kids, because I'm happy just eating meat. And a slice of cheese every now and then. But they want the sauces. They want the pasta. They want the sweet stuff. And I'm trying to just. Yeah, that's, why I, that's why I waited until I was on my journey. For a good length of time. And I knew that I wasn't going to be um, tripping. But um. But um. But um. I love my finger. We are not doing the ASMR. My children love ASMRs. I have to admit. I like ASMRs too. There's not the weird ones, but there's the cinematic kind. Um, what's her name? Moonlight Cottage? Moonlight Cottage. She's on YouTube. I love to watch her videos. And... Today. This video is going nowhere, so I'm just going to conclude. I lost a pound. Yes, it's slow. The it's... Mermaid potion. Okay, I'm a mermaid now. Day 81, I've only lost 15 pounds, but I'm just happy. I'm happy because it's doable. And I feel amazing. I feel really flipping amazing. Like, it's unbelievable.